I'm with the grill master himself. Let's make the perfect lamb chops. How about you say hello to my little friend? So I want to slice them up like this so we have a nice, beautiful individual chop. Just make sure you go through the bone right here. That's the important part. Now in Guga's cute little hand blender, we're going to go in with half an onion, some garlic and ginger paste. To this, we got spicy with some sriracha. Hefty pinch of salt and black pepper. A nice pinch of gochugaru, which is just a Korean chili flake. Add some lemon juice. A good amount of avocado oil. And then we finish with Dijon and Worcestershire sauce. I don't know how in the world this little hand blender is going to actually blend this all, but Guga clearly stated that it will work. So I'm going to have him blend it. I can't hold it on my hand. I have to go like this. I like his excuses, Google. No, are you ready? It will work, I promise. <laughs> It's working. Of course it's working, my brother. I told you. <laughs> That's actually pretty good. It's working. I told you. This little thing is powerful. So now we throw the lamb chops into the bag. Marinade goes in. Ooh, we're making food. This looks like a, a laboratory, but that's what we do. Pulling a vacuum will actually help the marinade penetrate deeper into the meat. But if you don't have one, just leave it in your refrigerator for a few hours or even better, overnight. So basically to make these lamb chops, you need a laboratory. No, 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 no. <laughs> Five, four, three, two. Wait, wait, wait. That's sick. So what the vacuum chamber does, it opens up the fibers of the meat and it allows the marinade to penetrate deeply inside there. You can either do this or you can just let it marinate overnight. Basically, these are unattainable. <laughs> okay. This is why we're making the perfect lamb chops. How about you say hello to my little friend? Grace should be nice and beautifully hot. Let's do it. Oh, that smells gorgeous, Guga. So we got a beautiful, nice little sear. We're going to cover them up. And cook it in indirect heat. Do you see how juicy this is? Guga, I'm not going to lie to you. It smells amazing. You better believe it. And as always, now bismillah. Oh. Mm. <laughs> that's amazing it is fantastic medium rare i promise you that is actually incredible i was telling google i already know these are going to be amazing 